It really was all the fun of the fair at Festival Gardens. 200 stars made sure of that. Sidney Taffler and Joy Shelton. That's two identified to begin with, and they came thick and fast. Genial Jack Hawkins entered into the spirit of it, also Charles Hawtrey. The object of all the fun making was to raise money for the Variety Club charities. John Turner and Anne Haywood talked old campaigns with a few frontiersmen. When the stars went trying on hats, they were busy giving autographs. It all helped. David Jacobs was hard at it. Irene Handel. And if it isn't fugitives from that fine film, the pot carriers getting a breath of fresh air. As for Kenneth Moore, in any company, he's a gale of fresh air. June Thorburn, not so shy as a coconut. One smart customer was up to something. It was Sidney James. He got hold of beauty queen Margaret Bristow. Harry Fowler, for charity, anything within reason. Over to London Airport, and guess who's here? The girl of the Roaring Twenties, Dorothy Provine, or shall we say Pinky Pinkham. The girl who blew the gaff on how today's staid grandmothers behaved in the dim and distant when we went there to restrain them. In those roaring twenties, a lot of proposals were received in the old taxis. Welcome to Dorothy Provey, a shot in the arm for show business.